So it's Mothering Sunday today and I decided to do my first YouTube on a very special day and we're going to go to the, the peninsula in Kowloon in Hong Kong and I'm very excited. I've been treated by my lovely daughter and my lovely fiance. Um, so today I thought it would be a perfect day to do a look. Hi, back again. Okay, so I'm going to do a quick smoky eye. Uh, I'm going to do a bold lip, so I don't want it to be too. I've decided to use a Tom Ford palette for my eye look. So I always put concealer all over my eyelid because I'm so knackered at the moment with Lana being up every minute of the night. And I've had, we've had, all had the worst um, throat infection. So we're all feeling a bit lousy. So it just clears up my eyeball. Um, and I use two brushes to keep it really simple. <laughs> and the first one I'm going to get, I'm going to get a really sparkly uh, eyeshadow. For this one. You see it's been used to house, so I should have kind of cleaned it. Just put this all over the eyelid. Be generous with it. Sparkly. <laughs> I'm just gonna look into the mirror. To get to know you, baby. Always have some good tunes on when you're doing your makeup. Totally gets you in the mood. Okay, and then with their little brush. Go in with a sparkly right in the top of your eye, so in, in that part. I just kind of throw it on, you know, I'm in a bit of a rush. Obviously being a mum and having people rush you, <laughs> uh, you need to you need to look quick and easy to do. So it's really sparkling here. And then I'm going to, I would like to use a base colour, like all of it, this part. Just so you set the concealer. The base colour is just like a nude. Like, um, like that one, like that nude in there. Like this one here. Okay. Now in the palette, I'm going to go with the transition colour. Yeah, I'm going to go in with the grey. Because I'm using coral on my lips, so I don't want it to be too. So this brush is amazing because it's slanted. I'm going to place most of the colour on the outer corner. And then sweep it through. Go for it. Don't be too right, soft. Just once you get the colour here, then just swipe it. Okay. Already up in my eyes. cotton bud, I've just got a cotton pad, and just kind of get rid of any excess colour on your brush, and then you just want to blend it out, I just go for it, I don't really care, okay, then with the third colour here, I'm just going to get this on the tip of the brush, I'm just going to trail that right through the socket again. The pigments from Tom Ford are absolutely amazing. Like the quality, oh my god, they're so good. Just as good as Charlotte Tilbury and that as well. I find that you have to So I'm 33 and, and I'm starting to see like my eyes start to hood my look. So I always have to really now. Accentuate my eyes, like make them look bigger. Okay, and then with the darker one, I'm gonna get my small brush, small drawing brush, that one. And then on that outer corner, I'm gonna create a bit of depth to my eyelid. It's an everyday kind of glamour look. I don't want to bring it too high up because I don't want to look like a but it's just like me, like how I do my own makeup, you know, like, 
it's good to have like that you look straightforward at your makeup. You don't really have to like go like this, but keep your, your face kind of neutral. Build that up to like whatever you desire. It's all about like amazing eye makeup. It's all about Josh. Would you just start out Lana? Sorry, I'm losing a photo because my daughter is literally like uh, slamming her ball. She's only having fun. It's pretty quiet, I like, where you try to like concentrate. Okay, I'm happy with that. Okay, um. Underneath, I think I need a little bit of something, but I'm not going to go in too dark. I might use the glitter. Whatever's left on this brush from doing that deck. We'll uh, just give you like a really nice smoldy look. I'll mix it in with the glitter that I use at the start. And just give it a real good smudge. I don't really want this to look too neat. I just want it to look like I've just... Okay. Uh, then I'm going to put a little bit of depth in my lashes. So I'm just going to literally draw this in my lashes. That plum, that plum again. And now I'm going to apply concealer. So I just start quite low and then... And build it up. Oh, this is concealed. Try not to put too much um, here. Or if you do, just make sure you really blend it out. I call my concealer my razor. Because it just... cleans up everything. Now I've just launched a new concealer, which I've just purchased. But Hong Kong prices are... Ugh, killer. So, this is it. Look at the difference. <clears throat> um, for any like pimples or like scarring or whatever, it diffuses it out. It makes the skin look super clean. Sometimes if I'm really tired, I put the product here. Just a little bit. And voila, you look super, super clean. Okay, and then I'm gonna do it on the other side my products everywhere. So start quite low. By the time you get to here you haven't got as much product. Clean it all up. And then just look. Just put a little bit down my nose. I get quite a red nose, oh. but I'm baffing because I want to look super close. And then get the super concealer, and then the new one, which is called Soft Matte Complete Concealer. Let's see how the looks looking. So I'm literally gonna. Go around with the lip liner now, tiny. If you want your lip liner slightly up, not down, because I find you end up getting a big smudge. I want like a really thin. with a lip brush. I'm just going to smudge it up.
really fresh look. Now, my little trick is I always like to go around it with concealer. Sorry. Show me out the corners. I won't do the whole. It depends how much you've botched it up. I love the uh, cream brow gel from NARS. Oh my god, the colour is amazing. It's like a really kind of like blondy colour. So when I do my brows, I do well underneath first. So I do well underneath and then I do the arch. Then I'm going to go with powder to make it look on the arch. Again, if you can watch at your brows, just use your eraser, concealer. I don't like thick brows. Like that for me is enough. Then again, concealer. If I've botched up the line, because sometimes I just, just throw it on. Um, to go underneath. This is where you get a real point. My uh, bronzer. Right, and then the last bit of the makeup is uh, I'm going to use this palette. I'm going to have to find out what it is. I think it's the HD palette. Um, so I'm just going to use the powder just to make it even more crisp. Mix it up smoother. my look. I'm going to take my hair down. Ready? Let's celebrate Mummy's Day! <sighs> Idiot. <laughs>